Many people believe that the way humanoid robots move nowadays look like they've just had 20 shots of tequila, or worse, like someone being wobbly after hearing they didn't win the presidential election. However, what do you think about a humanoid robot moving at a speed of 7.38 miles an hour or 3.3 meters a second, a speed that must be acknowledged as comparable to humans? It set a world record for the fastest robot and is rumored to be a nightmare for Tesla's robot. Unitree H1 Robot 150,000. That's what we want to mention in today's episode. Welcome to Tesla Car World. Please show your support by subscribing and ringing that bell. Now, let's get started with today's content. In fact, when it comes to competitors in Tesla's humanoid robot field, the list is extensive. However, if we were to highlight one robot with superior specifications compared to Tesla's Optimus, Unitree H1 from China is getting lots of attention. It's expected to cost much less than a car. Bring it so, to the right here. Uh, I would say probably less than $20,000 would be my guess. The anticipated selling price of the Tesla bot is always an advantage. Confidently securing customer preference as $20,000 is not a significant amount to make many people hesitate. However, when it comes to Unitree H1, it's a different story. Yeah, $150,000, the selling price set by the manufacturer. Yes, that is quite expensive. It's more expensive than two Model X cars combined and may lead many of us to reconsider adding it to our shopping carts. Previously, when discussing the price of Optimus, Elon Musk mentioned that their robot would be cheaper than a car produced in millions every year. This, this is, Optimus is designed to be an extremely capable robot but made in, in very high volume, probably ultimately millions of units, um, and it, it, it is expected to cost much less than a car. While Unitree has been commercialized and is set for early delivery this year, on Tesla's end, Musk has stated that Optimus is still in the development phase to achieve maximum utility, with few deliveries expected in 2025. For a robot priced at $150,000, it must undoubtedly feature superior technologies worthy of the price, at least holding the title of the fastest humanoid robot in the world. So, what makes Unitree H1 confident that it'll overwhelm the Tesla bot? Similar to the Tesla bot, Unitree H1 is designed with various applications in mind, including research and development, education, and service industries. Speaking of its size, as you can see, it truly looks quite simple from design to appearance, all wrapped in a mysterious black color that makes everyone eager to explore. We're not sure if humanoid robot manufacturers adhere to any specific size standards, but the truth is, from Atlas Boston Dynamics, Tesla Bot, Kepler Forerunner, and Unitree, they all fall within 5 feet 10 inch range, a size that brings efficiency and resembling human stature the most. Not stopping there, to achieve the ability to walk at a speed of 3.3 meters a second, Part of it seems to rely on the impressive weight of the Unitree H1, compared to the 103 pounds. Looking at the simplicity of this humanoid robot, surely the manufacturer must have focused quite a bit on the material and weight of the machinery inside it. You can simply focus on its head, which is an interesting hollow head. Of course, 103 pounds is significantly lighter than the current 138 pounds of Tesla's bot, and its speed also surpasses considerably the 0.6 meters per second of Optimus. Optimus only has two degrees of freedom in its feet for balance. Unitree H1 has the advantage of being both light and tall, designed to maintain a stable standing posture, even in situations requiring enduring strong shocks at fixed points. It remains stable even when it's kicked. The special thing is based on a maximum torque of up to 360 Nm at the knee, hip torque of 220 Nm, so this robot can confidently move and operate on difficult terrain and in complex environments. Detailed information about the number of degrees of freedom in the leg section has also been revealed. There's a total of five degrees of freedom, including three at the hip, one at the knee, and one at the ankle. This indicates the flexibility and adaptability of the robot across various terrains and in many different situations. The Unitree H1 not only demonstrates unprecedented walking speed, but also showcases advanced whole body coordination by dancing, climbing up and down stairs effortlessly, as well as doing high jumps comparable to those of a man standing next to it. All these possibilities raise concerns that there will be a big gap between the two robot technologies. Is this true? Alongside its sturdy, stable design, high flexibility, and superior mobility, the H1 excels in adapting to various complex environments and terrains. At first glance, it may seem incredibly impressive enough to leave the Optimus robot behind, but in reality, both the Unitree H1 and the Tesla bot boast equally efficient performance metrics without significant differences, with Tesla Optimus even slightly edging out. 
Firstly, it's quite puzzling to learn that the Unitree H1 only has 864 watt hour battery pack and a maximum voltage of 67.2 volts. With such a battery size, the robot will operate for a shorter period, approximately around 5 hours or less, due to Unitree's relatively fast walking speed, which consumes more energy. For modern industrial robot products, this seems lower than the prevailing standard. Typically, robots designed for continuous operation over long periods are equipped with more robust battery systems, especially in applications that require a continuous operation like in industrial environments. At TeslaBot, the initial prototype was confirmed to come equipped with a 52-volt, 2.3-kilowatt-hour 2 battery pack with integrated electronic devices for cooling and energy management, located in the chest area of the body. With the Gen 2 update, Tesla engineers have been able to upgrade to a higher-capacity battery pack in the latest update but they are hesitant to disclose it because they were worried about copying that continues to occur. The standard 2.3 kilowatt hour battery pack allows Optimus to operate continuously throughout the day or somewhere around 20 hours depending on the usage scenario. As you know, battery technology has always been a strong point for Tesla. However, the choice of Unitree H1 may have a different strategy. They may be focusing on optimizing energy efficiency, such as using advanced technologies to optimize power usage from available battery packs. This can help reduce the weight and size of the robot, making it more flexible in real-world applications. Another theory could be that the Unitree H1 is designed to operate in specific environments and should be recharged regularly. In this case, a battery pack with a larger capacity may not be necessary and may increase both the size and cost of the robot with no obvious benefit. What do you think about the battery packs of both the Unitree H1 and Tesla's Optimus? Next, let's talk about how these humanoid robots perceive their environments. The Unitree H1 vision system achieves incredible performance by combining a depth camera and 3D LiDAR Plus technology. This integration allows the robot to collect highly accurate spatial data in real time, creating a 360-degree panoramic scanning of the environment. Not only does it help the Unitree H1 recognize and avoid obstacles while moving, but it also gives it incredible depth perception of its surroundings. Meanwhile, the Tesla bot is equally impressive with similar observation tools as Tesla cars. With eight autopilot cameras integrated into its head, or often referred to as its eyes, the robot sends vision data about the surrounding world to its onboard computer brain for real-time analysis. In the head section, there also exist three separate CMOS sensors facilitating visual navigation through volumetric debt rendering. The Tesla bot has the ability to sense and react to its surrounding environment automatically and accurately. The most recent video of Optimus moving around the factory has clearly demonstrated this capability. It's worth noting the presence of an interactive display on the face, aiding the robot in effective communication and information display. This screen plays a crucial role not only in conveying information, but also in interacting with users, potentially replacing or supplementing voice communication. Tesla will soon introduce this feature. What is special about the hand manipulation of two robots? The Unitree robot is designed with a unique structure, especially in its hand portion. Initially, it appears similar to the hand of Boston Dynamics' Atlas, with some variant options lacking fingers for convenience in certain tasks. However, when needed for grasping and carrying objects, this hand automatically equips additional flexible fingers. A clear sample is in the introductory video, where you can see the Unitree robot transporting a basket of items and placing it on a table flexibly and swiftly. As far as we know, Unitree has integrated four degrees of freedom for this robot's hand portion. However, it can be observed that these four degrees of freedom may be limiting for performing more delicate tasks that require higher flexibility. The Tesla bot features a structure with 28 drive units and a joint system that mimics biological movements, mechanically similar to human joints. The Gen 2 upgrade allows it to have up to 11 degrees of freedom to execute complex and flexible motions similar to human arms. You can see it making progress in tasks such as holding slippery objects like eggs or skillfully folding a garment. Optimus's carrying capacity allows it to lift up to 45 pounds. On the other hand, the 11 degrees of freedom can allow the robot to perform a variety of tasks, including holding and moving objects and performing simple assembly tasks. How outstanding about the AI systems of these two robots? Every robot manufacturer integrates special technologies in their products, with a chip system playing a crucial role, determining the overall performance of the robot. Recently, Unitree announced that they're using the Intel Core i7-1265U processing chip for their robot line, one of the leading chips on the market today. This processing chip is evaluated with a high-performance score of up to 13,824, surpassing previous U-Series chip versions. 
This superiority can be easily understood when considering the chip's architecture, with up to 10 cores and 12 threads, providing powerful processing capabilities. Using this chip, Unitree's robots will become more powerful and flexible than ever in processing information, planning, and decision-making, as well as executing movements accurately and efficiently. The flexibility and high performance of the Intel Core i7-1265U chip will help this robot easily adapt to diverse work environments and perform a complex tasks effectively. However, the TDP of the Intel Core i7-1265U reaches up to 15 watts, a relatively high figure compared to the limited power available in the 864 watt hour battery pack of the Unitree robot. This leads to a relatively high power consumption and also contributes to the relatively high price tag for this chip, a factor contributing to that $150,000 price point. What's special about Optimus is the integration of Tesla's SOC AI chip connected to the Dojo supercomputer, unlocking powerful data processing capabilities through Tesla's proprietary artificial intelligence system along with the FSD processor. This is precisely what many consider to be a pinnacle technological achievement of Tesla. Designed and manufactured exclusively by Tesla, this chip is not only the heart but also the brain of Optimus providing superior capabilities not only in data processing, but also in control, connectivity, and security. Of course, regarding the principles and specific specifications of this chip, Elon Musk cannot disclose detailed information about this technology due to concerns about theft. With its high processing capabilities, the Tesla SOC chip is the dynamic intelligence of Optimus. From the data collected from cameras and radar, this chip helps the robot recognize and understand its surrounding environment. Its quick and accurate computations enable Optimus to react and adapt to the environment in real time, enhancing performance and safety during operations. Not just an ordinary processor, the Tesla SoC chip also serves as the central control hub of Optimus. From adjusting movements to executing complex tasks, this chip ensures that every operation of the robot runs smoothly and efficiently. With integrated Wi-Fi and LTE connectivity capabilities, the Tesla SoC chip allows Optimus to access the internet and interact with online data sources. This opens up a world of information and learning opportunities for the robot, from updating to the latest information to interacting with users through online applications and services. Particularly, the security of this chip is also given top priority. With deeply integrated security features, the Tesla SoC chip ensures that Optimus is always safe from threats such as unauthorized access and network attacks, keeping the robot's data and operations securely protected. In addition to the Tesla SoC chip, Optimus also utilizes a range of other chips to perform specific functions. From image processing chips for cameras to motor control chips, each component is optimized to ensure the robot's maximum performance and operational capabilities in every situation. This makes Optimus one of the smartest and most flexible robots out there, with the ability to adapt and react strongly to every situation. Unitree Robotics entered the field of robot development in 2016, embarking on a long and challenging journey. From deep research to practical testing and development, they've accumulated a valuable wealth of experience in this industry. In the relentless race of the humanoid robot industry, continuous improvements and advancements are undeniable. Unitree Robotics breaking the world record for speed is a significant step, demonstrating the innovation and relentless efforts of technology developers. Meanwhile, Tesla, a giant in the electric vehicle industry, has only recently begun to venture into the field of robotics in the last two years. Despite holding strong technological foundations from previous projects, they're facing unique challenges as they transition from car manufacturing to robot development. During this time, Tesla's diligently ramping up the final steps with its robot. They have a series of clear objectives, from autonomous capabilities to human interaction, to ensure that their product not only achieves technological advancement, but also meets the needs and desires of the market. The race for humanoid robots is about to kick off as Tesla is currently seeking a technical service writer to create user manuals for their humanoid robot Optimus. The company seems to be making significant progress on the Tesla robot, and pre-order registrations may likely start by the end of the year. Tesla actively seeking technical service writers to create user guides for the Optimus robot is an extremely positive signal, indicating that the time when we see this robot on the market is not far off. The technical writer position also suggests that the opening of the registration program for Tesla Optimus is likely approaching. Last week, Tesla posted new job openings, introducing real-world tests for Optimus at various gigafactories. 
Currently, Tesla is researching its own private 5G infrastructure to connect its electric vehicles and autonomous robots. The 5G network provides much lower latency, under 5 milliseconds, compared to the 4G network, which ranges from 60 to 98 milliseconds. This speed allows Optimus to receive information faster and smoother in many tasks. A company has declared that 14% of manufacturing and automotive jobs will be automated within the next four years, and Goldman Sachs predicts that the humanoid robot could hit $38 billion by 2035, at least if robots like Optimus can become as capable as their manufacturers assert they'll be. The Tesla Optimus robot and the Unitree H1 are playing crucial roles in the global technological revolution, not only for their ability to optimize production processes, but also for their aim to create a safe and efficient working environment. Integrated with artificial intelligence and robotics, these robots not only help reduce labor-intensive tasks, but also can perform dangerous and complex missions that humans either cannot do or don't want to undertake, such as labor in nuclear plants or military environments. The application of these technologies not only enhances productivity, but also brings significant benefits to society, from reducing workplace accidents to cutting production costs. The Tesla Optimus robot and Unitree H1 are not just symbols of the technological advancement, but also evidence of the sustainable development and social consciousness of leading technology companies. What do you think about the battle of Optimus Robot and Unitree H1 Robot, and how do you feel about the benefits they can do? We appreciate your contributions. If you want to see more analysis videos about Tesla's humanoid robot Optimus, check out our other videos on Tesla's Car World channel. We hope you'll have the most relaxing feelings after watching our video. If you did, please hit that like button and join the Tesla Car World family by subscribing to our channel. And don't miss out on any of our awesome videos by hitting the bell icon. We value your feedback and your time. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Until then, take care, stay safe, and God bless.